They're scoring up well. Second event of the night from Newcastle. Mobile makes its way into the home straight. Green light goes up. And they're away. And the Plainsman shows good pace. Sir Lefer likewise. Lorad Mahagan down and out. A line of four running into the first turn. Just behind them always bad. And Robbie will make it on the inside. It's going to get a nice run through from the second line. And then Lively Nick, who's in the centre. A little bit tight as they leave the straight. My Whiskey Lullaby is uh, further back then. And then came Run to Hide, who's got about four behind it. They include uh, Come Collect, Always Amy, and Last is Who Killed Kenny. So into the back straight they run. They're about to hit the mile mark. And the lead time comes up in... 31.4 which is fairly standard and the Plainsman held the inside barrier and held the lead. Leads out over Lerad Mahag and Robbie Will Make It is on the leader's back. Lively Nick trapped three wide so it slides up now looking for the spot outside the leader and then came Run to Hide who ends up three back on the inside. It's uh, on its outside in turn was Sir Lefer, then followed by Always Bad. Next was My Whiskey Lullaby in the running line who killed Kenny is sliding up on the inside saving ground on the pegs. Come collect back third last from Always Aim and uh, down and out is at the tail. So into the straight they come, and the first quarter, as they pass the uh, 1,200 metre point, came up in 30.4. And on top is the Plainsman. Led without too much trouble, it's the Plainsman by two metres. Lively Nick facing the breeze in second, and Robbie Will Make It is on the leader's back in third. Lorad Mahag won one, and Sir Lefer's on its back in the running line. Run to Hide is three back the inside, and Who Killed Kenny is on its back. And then came Always Bad, and the last five or six are all off the pegs. Always Bad midfield. Field, followed by my whiskey lullaby come collect always Amy and last is down and out pretty leisurely second quarter 32.0 so that's a 62.4 first half of the last mile and the Plainsman getting all the favours in front leads out by three metres over Lively Nick Robbie will make it Lerad Mahag and then run to hide on the inside always bad now pulls out Sir Lefer tries to go in front of it but can't do so who killed Kenny back on the inside my whiskey lullaby come collect always Amy is being driven uh, with a bit of urgency it's not wanting to pick up at the moment and down and out on its inside. 29-5 as they leave the back. It's the Plainsman on top and it's the one to run down. Robbie will make it as trying to get out from behind that leader. Lively Nick is still there, punching away, and then came Always Bad and uh, further back on the inside was Run to Hide, who gets the inside run as they straighten. The Plainsman drifted off the pegs. Run to Hide drives up on its inside. Robbie will make it, chimes in three wide. It's Robbie will make it and Run to Hide. Robbie will make it in front over Run to Hide. Come collect late, but Robbie will make it. Come collect, flashed home to get second. Run to Hide third. The Plainsman weakened into fourth. And then who killed Kenny Always? Amy Sir Lefer. Always Bad. Lively Nick. My Whiskey Lullaby, down and out, the last one in, Lerad Mahag, 29-2, final quarter.